every country has started concentrating on coming up or developing their own indigenous fifth generation stealth aircrafts in this video we would be going through the details of such projects made by south korea and india recently on october 15th 2019 south korea's main aircraft manufacturer which is known as korea aerospace industries unveiled the first mock up model of its indigenous stealth aircraft which is called kf x and this happened at an exhibition in seoul korea the kf x is a joint south korean and indonesian fighter aircraft program intending to develop an advanced multi role fighter for both republic of korea air force and indonesian air force same day which is october 15 2019 Indian Air Force Chief Air Marshal R K S Badoria implored the DRDO to expedite the India's advanced medium combat aircraft project which is called as AMCA India is independently developing a twin engine fifth generation super maneuverable stealth multi role fighter called the HAL advanced medium combat aircraft also known as AMCA So what is this fifth generation aircraft? To be more precise, fifth generation aircraft feature its design characteristics is to reduce the possibility of detection by enemy radar, the infrared sensors and carry advanced electronics communications. In addition, fifth generation aircrafts are meant to be highly agile and have the capability to carry their weapons inside the weapon bay that are enclosed in the aircraft's fuselage so this reduces the possibility of detection by radar and also decreases the drag on the aircraft as of now the only combat ready fifth generation fighters are lockheed martin f22 raptor lockheed martin f35 lightning 2 the chengdu j20 and sukhoi su57 of russia in what way the south korea's kfx and india's amca are similar as we see on the screen both kfx and amca aircraft models look very similar and the other thing which is similar is that both these aircrafts will be powered by united states general electric f414 jet engines the kfx and amca have a loaded weight of around 25 tons each and will be capable of carrying weapons and equipment both internally and externally both the aircraft support the european origin air to air missiles including the meteor long range missile and the meteor is nothing but it's being supplied to the indian air force for its fleet of rafale fighters as well So Meteor is an active radar guided beyond visual range air to air missile developed by MBDA. So Meteor offers a multi shot capability against long range maneuvering targets, jets, unmanned vehicles and cruise missiles in a heavy electronic countermeasures environment. So South Korean officials claim that KFX will be less stealthy than the US built F35 which the country is buying. The project has an estimated development cost of around 8 billion US dollars and South Korea plans to buy around 120 KFX aircrafts. This KFX is slated to make its first flight by 2022 and enter the production by 2026. coming to india's drdo the feasibility study for amca began in 2009 in 2018 the government sanctioned rupees 400 crore for this amca's detailed design phase and the drdo officials claim that they plan to fly the first prototype by 2025 so this was a quick update on south korea's kfx development program and india's standpoint with the AMC project I'll upload another video with another update from the defense side